Hey there, let's create our first eBay seller account with some managed uh, payment options. So it's really easy to do that. I'm going to leave you guys a link down below in the description so you can get your eBay seller account totally free and you might be getting a few rewards just by signing up. So you're going to be seeing something like this. So what I want to do is to fill all this information with my first, my last name, an email, and of course a passcode in order to continue. If you want to choose a Gmail account, a Facebook account, or an Apple ID account, you're totally good to go. But in my case, I'm going to do this in the manual way. If you want to choose whether you are a personal or a business account, you can do that. I can strongly suggest you guys to just stick around with the personal account because you might be needing to add a few legal stuff about your business account. So you don't want to mess around in here. Just uh, fit all your information. And once your account has been successfully created, what you want to do is to add an address. Uh, if you have some additional information, I'm just creating something really easy. Um, that is actually, I'm pretty sure this is not existent at the moment. But this is not the important part. The important part is that now that you have your account, what you want to do is to, uh, you, you don't want to, um, to, to mess around here because this is spam. Actually, this is not even in our language. So as you can see, this is just an ad. So you don't want to mess around in here. So what we want to do is to go into the cell option and here into the sell option, if I clicked in here, it says make money selling on eBay. Sell your uh, items fast, millions of buyers are waiting. You're gonna be choosing list and item. So I'm gonna hit in list and item. And once I am in here, it's gonna be asking, if, tell us what you're selling, start your listing, choose from possible matches, preview, make changes. So let's say for example, that we want to sell some fussy, sleepers you know, hit into for woman hit into search and here we can list some item here I'm gonna hit into let's say for example this is like a match that I can start to sell or continue without matching so this is new with boxed hit into continue to listing and what we can do here it's gonna be helping us to complete our I'm going to be exiting here our listing. So here we can import that from a web. We can import from a mobile. We can add a few photos. We can add some video. If you have some gallery, uh, there's a title, the item category. So all the information you want to fill, all the information about your, your item here. And after that, you want to go into listed. Now we have to pay for a final value fee when we list an item. Actually, when we make a sell into an item, we can go into the preview if you wanted to. So hit into save for later. And here, as you can see, it's gonna be appearing to all our actions, all our store or our uh, um, listing sections, right? So now what we want to do is to go into my eBay. I want to go into selling. So here into selling, we have the selling overview. I'm gonna hit into, okay, I got it. And here you have something to sell. We have 182 million buyers. So finish it. So here what we can do is to start selling. Uh, we can add a lot of options and we have a lot of links, but how can we get paid? How can we manage our payment options? So if you go into the selling options, you go into these options that says payments. I'm gonna just click it in here it says, welcome, this is where you can add and delete the payment options you have to buy and sell on eBay. So if I choose this option, it says continue. What I can do is to add my first payment option. So I'm gonna be choosing payment option. And I do have the option to add a credit or a debit card option for checkout. So if I choose this option, I'm gonna hit into continue. And after that, you want to add all this information. This is the billing address and hit into continue. What I can strongly suggest you before adding a payment option is to go into your personal information and to fill as much information as you can because uh, it's going to be asking you for a verification process. And since we are new here into eBay, sometimes the registrations are like a little bit difficult to pass. 
So what I want to do is to verify this email address. I want to choose the verify option. I want to verify this phone number. And once I do verify all these options, I have now an individual account verified. So I might be having less possibilities to not any issue with my payment section. So now that everything has been successfully done, hit into payment information and here we can go into the payment. Now, as you can see, we do have this option. It says PayPal account. Now this PayPal account is actually no longer available. Actually, you can see it in here. It's no longer available. I'm not pretty sure what happened there, but uh, just for security reasons, the only way that we can get paid and paid uh, on eBay is with a credit or a debit card. So uh, after that, you want to go into the payments, add your credit or your debit card. So I'm going to be choosing add a payment option. Do you already know how to do this? Add your card and you're actually good to go. So that means that if I make a listing into my eBay account, I'm going to be receiving um, the money into this card. And of course, they're going to be taking the fee. They're going to be taking uh, the shipping address, the shipping fees, everything about fees and stuff that we need to pay. For example, a fee for a listing or for your selling, they're going to be taking that away from our credit or our debit card. So I'm going to hit into the X button. And if I go into my eBay, I'm going to hit into summary. Now here into the summary, if I do have like a notification like that I need to verify my account, like something went wrong and I need to provide some more information. I need to do that SAAP because otherwise we might be having our store closed. So um, actually, as you can see, actually it was really, really simple. I can strongly suggest you to constantly check out your account. I do have uh, one message from eBay. So you clicked in here. Sometimes they'll be asking you to provide a few information or more about yourself. In my case, I only have like a few recommendations in money back guarantee. So speaking about the overview of the selling, if I hit into the selling option, if I go into the overview, I'm going to be seeing all the active orders that I have in here. How many products has been sold? How many products I have unsold? Cause and the money I've gained in the past 90 days total. Now, if I want to list an item, I have this blue button of list an item. I do have the sell an item. We know how to use draft. And if you want to schedule a, a specific uh, listing, you can put it in here. You can choose to see all your active orders. You can see all your sold and all your owned sold orders. And of course, there are the shipping labels. Now, speaking about the shipping labels, if you want to sell an item and you want to add a specific order number, tracking number, you don't have to go directly into the shipper, for example, the HL or UPS. You just need to provide the tracking number that was sent for you and you need to paste that in here. And after that, well, actually, it's really, really easy to track an order that you already have listed into your store. So now that we have know how to do this, the last thing to do into our eBay store is to start selling. So go into the sell option, go into the category that you want to sell, uh, hit into list an item, create a new draft start your listing and you are good to go so once again guys i'm going to leave you a link down below in the description if you don't have an ebay account if you want to start selling here into ebay remember to verify your account and provide as much information as you can about yourself so you get banished get banned in the future for any reason this is only for security uh verification stuff so thank you for watching this video don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this ebay application platform uh thank you so much for watching this video guys and i'll see you on the next one